Alright guys, welcome back to the channel. Before I get into it, it'd be massively appreciated if you went ahead and dropped a like on the video. Cheers. So as we all know, our youth department is now running at the highest level in the country, meaning that we will always have players ready to make that next step up for us. And we'll always have our players being looked at by other teams from around the world, especially down south in the English top flight. So we've actually already seen the departures of Rory Wilson who joined Aston Villa this summer, leaving our youth department on a permanent transfer. And with that said, it will always be a struggle to keep these players for longer than we can if we don't have enough space for game time to keep them happy. And with that said, it would now appear that Rangers man Cole McKinnon is is reportedly being tracked by Newcastle United. So the Rangers talent has done very well on loan at Partick Thistle this campaign. And the English Premier League outfit have dispatched scouts to watch the talented midfielder on several occasions now. So Cole McKinnon moved to Ian McCall's side on a season-long loan deal this summer. But Newcastle are weighing up making a bid for him in January and that's actually according to the Scottish Sun. But his pathway to the first team seems to be blocked with fellow talented midfielders Alex Lowry and Charlie McCann also struggling for minutes. So Rangers actually tied McKinnon down to a new contract until 2025 before letting him join Partick Thistle on loan this season. And it would seem that it would take a significant bid for Ibrox Chiefs to consider any potential offers from Newcastle. So what do you guys think then? Personally, I hope we don't see him leave this January, as I think he is definitely a high-rated player for us in Glasgow, and it would be very good to see more of him after his loan spell this season. However, I do think we know that players can't leave us no matter what the level, and if offers come in that we can't refuse for him, we might then see him leave us as I suppose every player does have a price at our level. But I think all we can do right now is wish him all the best of luck during his loan spell this season, and hopefully when that's done we can see him playing at a first-team level on a regular basis. But let me know what you guys think down in the comments, and subscribe for daily videos. Cheers!